This investigation will help students learn the difference between physical and chemical weathering processes. They should understand that erosion can occur very rapidly or very slowly. To demonstrate an example of physical weathering, students will fill an empty aluminum can with cold water, place it in a container with a flat surface, and leave it in a freezer for several hours. Be sure students take time to discuss what might have caused the aluminum can to break before they read the science stuff. Now have students combine a handful of rocks in a disposable plastic jar with some hard candy, screw on a lid, and shake the jar. After shaking several times, they should examine the broken pieces and describe them. Remove a few pieces of candy fragments and add a few drops of water to them. Allow them to dry for a few minutes and examine them again to see if they are sticking together. Part B will take a few days for chemical weathering to occur. Students should take a plain steel wool and dip it in a solution of salt water. It should be placed in an empty plastic tub or other container. Over the next few days, continue to dip it in the salt water. After several days, they should examine the steel wool again and record the changes that they notice.